So what we'll be doing today is to power our LED Zigbee controller to the SmartThings hub to control our LED strip light. So obviously make sure the light is turned on for pairing. So firstly, you will have to download the SmartThings app from your Play Store or App Store, depending on what device you have. Once you open the application, um, you would have to make sure to tap on the free horizontal line on the top left. Then go into devices. Then on the top right of the screen, just tap the plus sign. Then uh, scroll down onto lighting, tap lighting, then tap smart things. And then now tap smart bulb. Once you've tapped smart bulb, you just have to select um, the room where you'd like to control the light for example your living room or your bedroom or the toilet wherever you situate your light so for the purpose of this tutorial i've just have my room as test okay so just tap next after this now once you get onto this step the zb controller does not have a qr code to scan so you'd have to skip this step once you tap skip don't tap skip again because we have to go back onto our ZB controller and put it into pairing mode. Once you get to your ZB controller, you have to put the ZB controller into pairing mode. And you can do so by pressing the program button five times. So I'm just going to go ahead and press it five times. Now, once you've pressed the button five times, you want to go back onto your phone, tap skip. The LED strip will intermittently flash and it should, yes, connect onto your SmartThings hub then you can go ahead and um, rename your light then once you rename the you can go back and test the um, the pairing and see if the pairing was successful so you go back on the free horizontal line on the top left you go into devices and then there it is our one is called generic rgbw light so i'm just gonna tap on it and then you can adjust the lights to different colors so for example green then you can switch the light to maybe let's see blue and then to purple any color you like to switch the light to then uh, of course you can also adjust the brightness of the light on, on the application and there's loads of other features that you can let's say have a look at through the application now that's all from us thank you very much for listening i hope that this video was quite helpful once again please click like share it and subscribe and see you next time